In this video, we're going to recore a radiator. And the red arrows point to both side tanks that are going to be removed and replaced. And we're going to do all this at Radiator Land in Santa Clara, California. This picture shows a new radiator core without the tanks soldered on each side of the core. This picture shows the tubes that go across the radiator, and that's where the water flows, and it, that's where it gets cooled. These are underneath the tanks that are soldered on both sides. There's little holes that let the water go through each of the tubes that go across the radiator. This is the old radiator. You see it's pretty gummed up, and a lot of these tubes don't work. Besides that, it was rusted and leaking, and that's why we needed a new core. The green circle shows the entire radiator on the repair tank, ready to go to be uh, tanks to be removed and replaced. You can see what he's doing here. He's heating up the solder with the torch, and he's using the air nozzle to blow it away. And he just keeps on repeating the process until it removes enough solder so that they can take the tank off the radiator core.
you'll see he is uh, brushing the flux into the metal so that it ensures a good bond between the brass tanks and the copper radiator cork. You'll see here that he's using a torch to solder the tanks onto the cork. Put a little flux on there. Heat it back up. There he is, applying more solder. A little heat, solder, until he goes all the way around the whole side. Then he'll flip on the other side. You'll see here that the tank is completely soldered onto the core. So what will happen now is he will turn it on the other side and repeat the entire whole process. The next step is to put rubber caps over the areas here where the hoses go for the inlet and outlet of the radiator. And then you put the radiator underneath the water and then you put air under there under pressure and you'll see if it bubbles any place and where it bubbles is where it leaks and has to be resoldered. If not, then the process is all done.
So here's the radiator all done. Both tanks are soldered on. The whole thing is all painted black, ready to go for installation.